Yo guys, what's going on? Zace is here today with another video and in today's video we are doing items of the week part 3. Guys, I just woke up so I do apologize for the voice this morning, but I did have to show you guys really quickly before we get into it that the found in raid status has now been applied to weapons. As you can see, you cannot sell an item which was not found in raid. They have now nerfed the flea market for weapon flipping. Um, I'm assuming a lot of people we're doing that and um you know i know people were selling their twitch drops when they got weapons from that as well so they probably got annoyed with that and then just decided to turn the fountain raid status on the weapons as well so we can no longer flip weapons and i had to tell you guys that i'm not going to remove the first two videos because there's no point i spent time in making them and i can just redirect you guys to further in the series where we are checking out some other items that will work and make you guys some money so guys, we are going to be taking advantage of a hideout craftable today. So if your hideout is not upgraded, I do recommend upgrading your hideout. The hideout is where you're going to make the most money in this game. I mean, you make so much money off the Bitcoin farm alone and, um, you know, scav case and other things in here. You make so much cash and um, it really does allow you to advance a lot further into the game just by having this upgraded. But we're going to be taking advantage of the workbench. And I don't know what level you need to be, but the uh, craftable we're going to be taking a look at here today is going to be the M67 and the RGD, I think, or yeah, RDG smoke grenade. And um, we are going to be making Eagle gunpowder. And I want to show you guys right now. Eagle is selling for about 70k. And um, the M67 grenades, if you find them in raid, you definitely want to sell them on the flea market. Because the M67 grenades are going for stupid high. However, Peacekeeper does sell them. I don't know what level for Peacekeeper you need to be. I am at max loyalty for all traders. I'm level 40. But... Um, I don't know which level you have to be for Peacekeeper. That's something you can easily look up on the Tarkov wiki, or you can throw it on screen if I remember. But um, the M67 is only 87 USD for one of these. So I'm going to show you guys here if we go over and purchase 880 bucks from um, Peacekeeper, how much that's going to be than the smoke grenades, which we only need five of them. So if we just do, we'll just do 890 uh, USD here from Peacekeeper, and that's going to cost us 103,000 rubles so we're going to go ahead and do that right now and then we are going to go ahead and buy some smoke grenades from proper we need five of them so we'll buy five and that's another you know 30k or so so we're investing we'll say 135k and you will make that back in two of your eagles which you can make five from the total purchase here and you can do this every single restock for um, peacekeeper and you also have the trade here for the zippos if you wanted to go with those but um, we're going to buy all 10 of these and you do get a very slight discount um, it used to be a lot higher of a discount but um they did kind of fix that as well so the m67 you got a slight discount there we're going to buy all 10 of those and you have those there and now you can head on over to the hideout and start crafting your eagle gunpowder now you can stock up on these items you can throw them into your uh you can buy a grenade case which you know it only will take you like three eagle gunpowders to be able to afford a grenade case maybe four or five i don't know but um you know depending on how those are doing but you can hand those over and you can start that craftable and this is going to take you uh, a little over 90 minutes about you know 100 minutes or so an hour and a half um and 30 and an extra seven so 97 minutes to do this but um guys this one's a super easy one because of that peacekeeper price you're not paying the you know regular inflated price for the m67s and this is going to net you um 70k per eagle and you can make five of them at a time so you really start to profit right after you make that second one the third fourth and fifth is going to be your profit and you know having the 70k each that's going to get you about 210k each time you go through all of your items so it really is the easiest profit right now if you wanted some other profit if you don't want to stick with this method i'll show you another one it is the ofz you need one ofz shell for 10 rgd I, I can never get those two right you know the smoke grenades and the uh frag grenades the rgd hand grenades they um you get 10 of them at prime time during the day like you know 5 p.m eastern time they will be selling for 15k uh, typically they have around the 12k mark the ofz shells 
will cost you about a hundred thousand right now. They used to be around 60k and it was super profitable right now, though a lot of people know about it. OFC shells are currently up to 100k, but you can do this trade if you want. This one is roughly the same amount of time, though, so I don't recommend it. I recommend just you know going for that. Uh, extra, you know, 210,000, you can make this 210,000 probably, um, you know, what, one time a day, maybe twice a day if you're playing all day, but you can really just grind these eagles out and, um, you know, throw this stuff in a grenade case. You don't even have to use it. Just throw it in the grenade case. It's not taking up stash space and um, you'll make a lot, man. You'll make a lot. So it's, you know, it's not a, an insanely fast method like um, some of my other money making guides are but i want to show you guys pretty much every single way in tarkov you can make some cash and that way you can diversify your money making skills and then when certain things like the weapons get nerfed you have something to fall back on so obviously we're only on episode three right now and we're really starting to grind it out but you know if you guys stuck around the last season for items of the week we had what 17 18 items of the week and there was just an insane amount of stuff that i had for you guys to rotate through and make a bunch of cash so do not worry i'm going to be finding tons of ways to get you guys a ton of money and um there's also going to be different money guides here on my channel it's not just going to be items of the week there's a money guide right now on how to get free sr25 ammunition and magazines and those magazines will work and that ammunition will work for any of the 762 by 51 so make sure you check that out i'll leave it up in the top right for you if i remember but guys this is pretty much it for items of the week episode three like i said i know it is not an insanely fast money making guide but it's definitely going to get you started on making some more ca cash here in Tarkov. So if you do me a huge favor, leave a like on a man, subscribe for your new channel sponsors and equipment description below, along with the membership option next to the subscription button. That's all I got. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'm out.